Hello friends, today we are going to talk about, Taiko. Taiko has recently arrived in the market, by the ThoughtWorks team. Over the time we have seen how Selenium has been developed, from Selenium IDE to Selenium WebDriver 2. But, automating with Selenium is still a tedious task. You still need to write complex code to move between tabs, to handle alert dialogues and move to third-party tools like AutoIT to upload a file. Well, Taiko makes these things much easier. Taiko is an open-source web automation tool. Currently, it works with Chrome browser only, whereas on Windows, Mac OS and Linux platform. We'll see how it reduces the code complexity once we get to the coding part. Now to install Taiko, you need to have Node.js installed in your system. You can download Node.js from the following website. Now to download Taiko, you need to hit the following npm command, in command prompt. To check the installed Node.js version, enter npm version. As Node.js is already installed in my machine, let's quickly download the Taiko. Taiko has successfully downloaded, you can see that it has also downloaded Chromium browser as well. Let's move forward and run Taiko, in command prompt and automate few web pages. To start, just type Taiko. Taiko command is as simple as a one can easily tell it over phone conversation. To open a browser, just write open browser. Go to, is used to navigate to a URL. Now to click on a web element, we don't necessarily need to find XPath. Here we will click on more button, but in web page there are two similar more elements. So, like Selenium we will use its parent element or nearby web elements. As we can see that the more button is on the right side of the gift cards, therefore we will use to write of and provide gift cards in it. Now, unlike Selenium where we use JavaScript to scroll the web page, here we have built-in functions to do the same. We can also use CSS selector and Selenium XPaths. Unlike Selenium, we don't need to write the implicit wait for the web page to open. By default, it will wait for 30 seconds for the page to load and if it doesn't then it will throw an exception. Here we will fill the sign up form. The input field, points to the first text box present on the web page. To fetch all the valid executed commands, we use .code command. And to save the following commands in a file, just provide the file name after .code command. For more information, you may go to following Taiko docs page. We will also be updating rest of the Taiko features on our channel, regularly with some more interesting commands. Thanks for watching friends, have a nice day.